the altcoins are dropping heavily and the massacre is most likely just beginning we'll be discussing right now how is that possible that bitcoin at the same time stayed stable and didn't make another lower low and if the move to $21,000 is finally happening we'll be discussing where the money were flowing into we'll be looking at bitcoin dominance and we will again update ethereum signal and show you with the highest probabilities what is going to happen next so if you are ready to know that truth make sure you are watching the whole video right now hello ladies and gentlemen this is Samo from my crypto paradise and right now we are looking at bitcoin on a four hour time frame as you can see the bitcoin from the previous video dropped and we have been discussing the possible relief pump as you can see right here if you have watched the video we have been expecting some kind of relief pump back to retest this trend line right here however it even extended the trend line made a fake out revisited our resistance right Right here at 27 to 27,700 dollars, and then dropped back down to our Fibonacci retracement level right here. So right now the formation looks like a double bottom formation right here, as you can see. Here is the neckline of our pattern of the double bottom, and if we take a look at relative strength index RSI right here, we can see quite difficult to observe on a first glance exaggerated divergence what does it mean it means that the price of bitcoin have made a retest of the previous low right here as i already said a double bottom formation however the indicator in this case we are using rsi made a higher low as you can see right here so at the same time while the price of bitcoin is making just a retest of the previous low the rsi is actually making high low what does it mean it means that we are creating something what is called exaggerated divergence and this is actually a bullish pattern formation so as you can see the indicator right here at the top is making high low the price is making equal low and that is creating an exaggerated bullish divergence so right now what we can understand from this signal is that there is a possible retest of our resistance zone however can we call this a bottom absolutely not why well first of all we need to understand that we are on a lower time frame creating a downtrend right here at the top where we explained to you the hidden head and shoulders pattern which you know from the previous videos thanks to that we have been expecting this drop from this channel right here we have been creating since this swing high a downtrend formation why because we have been creating lower highs together with lower lows as you can see right here lower highs after lower highs together with making another lower lows after lower lows so right now on a four hour time frame we we are creating this exaggerated divergence which can push the price of bitcoin here back to this resistance however until we can reclaim this previous lower high we are still in a downtrend what does it mean it means that if we zoom in a little bit more we can see that this is the neckline of the double bottom formation right because here we have first low then we jumped back up and we created a double bottom formation so this is the neckline of our double bottom formation and until we firstly break through this horizontal line right here reclaim it and then also reclaim this level which is previous local high we are still in a downtrend what does it mean it means that if you are really a professional trader you should totally respect the downtrend and only look for a short trades what does it mean that if we retest this resistance zone right here it will just be an opportunity to short bitcoin down we are not a perma bears you know that we have been calling the bottom of bitcoin since here since 19,500 successfully but right now when we are doing a downtrend and where the probabilities are shifting in terms of being in a short positions 
we just play with the probabilities ladies and gentlemen it's nothing against bitcoin we are just here to make money right so right now if this divergence exaggerated divergence is going to play out and we will get the retest of the resistance right here and of the neckline of our double bottom formation on a lower time frame we will use that not for long game we will use that to short again the bitcoin so right here even though the double bottom formation is a bullish pattern why we are not in a long position right now from the $25,800 because we are in a downtrend that means that even though this is a bullish formation double bottom formation and we also have this exaggerated divergence which is a bullish pattern as you see right here the probabilities of a pullback to that resistance is extremely low right now because we are in a medium time frame downtrend and even though there is a chance of retesting this resistance it would be just pure gambling so if you really want to be consistent in making profits you always need to have a proper trading strategy and stick to it our trading strategy is that we are not opening a long position right here if however we will retest this resistance we will definitely use that to again short bitcoin like increase we are already in a short with paradise family vips however we will increase our position size in terms of having more exposure towards a bearish bias all right so we are just playing with money management right here but i will not go deep into money management risk management because it is not necessary for this video right now i want to also discuss with you how is it possible that altcoins have been experiencing such a huge drops like 22 even 30 percent at some cases but bitcoin pretty much stayed stable right how is that possible well you can really see by looking at Bitcoin dominance. Right now we are on a daily time frame. That means that each candle representing a daily trading activity. That the money from selling altcoins has shifted to Bitcoin. You can see that very well on this green candle on Bitcoin dominance, which sent the dominance to 49% right here crossing the medium time from resistance which you know pretty well we have been discussing this resistance which is extremely important on bitcoin dominance in the previous videos and by crossing this resistance right here and already closing a daily candle right now you can see that already a new daily candle have been opened above this medium time frame resistance this automatically shifted this resistance into a support all right and right now everything what will come here will be respected just as a bullish retest all right what is the target for bitcoin dominance we already know that the money from the altcoins have shifted to bitcoin that is why bitcoin is being stable however what we can expect in the future from this kind of knowledge that right now we have crossed the resistance into a support well we can obviously suspect bitcoin dominance to keep growing but how much for that we will use a fibonacci retracement tool right now we will place first dot of that Fibonacci retracement tool at the swing high of Bitcoin dominance as you can see that is right here at 73% so that is going to be our first dot and then the second dot we will place right here at the swing low that will create beautiful box from our Fibonacci retracement levels we are using only the most important Fibonacci retracement levels I've been talking about these four Fibonacci retracement levels in the previous videos so you already know how important these are so this box is our resistance right now I will turn that into a red color because that is representing selling supply zone so let's make it red and as you can see the lower horizontal line of the fibonacci retracement perfectly works also with the flip of resistance into a support so here the price action been working as a resistance as you can see by these wicks right here then it broken 
to resistance and right here it worked as a support so extremely significant level by breaking the medium time frame resistance zone right here we can expect this will act like a support right now and we can expect the bitcoin dominance to retest this new resistance zone at around 60 to 65 percent that means we expect the trend of money flowing from altcoins into bitcoin to continue that is why it's very likely that most of the altcoins will continue experience more of the selling pressure and that means it will create more opportunities for us to short more of these coins and make money from it right now we will not be buying any new altcoins until the price action revisits this resistance zone right here after however the bitcoin dominance will grow to 60% that is going to be our extremely strong trigger to start buying the best picks altcoins for 100 even 200% because we will be expecting a new bullish cycle to start so it's just about buying low selling high with an extremely calculated strategy ladies and gentlemen and this is exactly what we will be doing together with our paradise family vips right now what do we expect from bitcoin is pretty clear we expect this fibonacci retracement zone to be broken we expect the twenty one thousand dollars to be retested finally fill the cme futures gap which i have been talking about in the previous five or six videos so you know exactly what we are looking at right here this is the cme futures gap together with our fibonacci retracement and structure support zone we will be creating another high low on a high time frame so this move is extremely expected and extremely important for our megaphone pattern to continue to seventy nine thousand dollars again if you know what megaphone pattern i'm talking about go and watch the previous video also i need to quickly update ethereum signal as you know from our previous video right here i've been showing you this signal many times already and we do still expect to hit at least this fibonacci retracement level right here we already retest once the 0.618 almost touching it right now ethereum is retesting this trend line right here which already got broken as you can see so this was an uptrend trend line boom with the current dropped it broken the trend line now we are having some bearish retest and we expect the price action to continue in a selling pressure so right now the ethereum long time frame video signal is already in around eight percent profit however we do expect this fibonacci retracement level at around 1540 dollars to be retested if we are not be able to create enough panic around retail that basically the funding rates are going to be extremely negative which right now as you can see is not happening on okx exchange and also not on binance exchange at the rest of exchanges you can see that the funding rates are quite negative right but the biggest ones the binance and okx basically people are still believing that this is just a small dump all right so they actually think this is the higher time frame bottom so based on this positive funding i'm quite scared that this is not going to be enough and we will need to reclaim this level as well and dump even lower so this is our next fibonacci retracement level at around 1144 dollars and if that will not be enough to shift that sentiment and scare most of the people out of the crypto market we will even need to retest our last fibonacci retracement level at around 900 dollars on ethereum that will make this signal something around 46 percent profit without leverage and it will be the ultimate signal that the new market cycle can start so ladies and gentlemen play it wisely level by level all right play it smartly be disciplined in your trading strategy soon this cycle is going to be finished we are just waiting for the bitcoin dominance to hit this level and we are ready to start buying the best picks of games in paradise family vip we are ready to keep shorting the market if that is going to be necessary it can take few days to get us into the shift or sentiment level 
but it can also take few months. We need to be patient, play it smartly, but what is extremely positive is that the volume is finally getting back to markets again. You can see the moves in altcoins were absolutely great. We have been seeing 20 to 30% moves and that is finally creating a great trading opportunity. So even though the price action is in a bearish manner, there is still a possibility to use that as a great opportunity for your trading. So ladies and gentlemen, if you are ready to start trading like a professional, I will see you in a Paradise Simile VIP right after watching this video. If you just want more education from Paradise team, go click on our website link in the description, click the join free button and join us on Twitter. Join us in our free Telegram channels where we are sharing all the insider info most of the people don't have access to and thanks to that you will, will be on the edge of the market and you will be much better than 90% of other traders because knowledge is the king right now ladies and gentlemen so stay focused and I will see you next time cheers